In this video, I'm going to be demonstrating for you guys the effect of combining a laser pointer with a diffractive optical element lens to create 2D images and patterns on a flat surface. So this video demonstration idea was suggested to me by fellow YouTuber and friend Cascobi. He picked up a pretty good one of these little lenses for fairly cheap. I'll link it below in the video description. It comes from the Material Sample Shop website and it goes for about 12 euros or 14 ish dollars and it does a pretty good job of explaining on that link as well how these work and it's basically the same concept if you've ever used one of the little star cap pattern pieces for one of your cheap eBay lasers it's pretty much the same concept the surface has a microstructure and when light passes through that microstructure the light is then diffracted into whatever the desired pattern is so you can basically make any pattern you want as you can see here on the right hand side, I have that little lens mounted up on a kind of tripod piece and I'm using a 473 nanometer 15 milliwatt DPSS laser right here. And you can see going along this top strip right here, I'm able to make a rotating globe appear on that flat surface. That's probably my favorite out of all of the, all of the images you can make with this. You can make four different images. Right there is just a logo that says CDA. And under that it says functional solutions. They're probably the manufacturer of this lens. Then we have a constellation pattern in a square. We have kind of like a moon and all of the different stages of a moon as we go across this circle right here. And then at the end we have some more stars. And if you center it up on that star image, there is also a constellation pattern with the dots connected. And I'm just going to give you guys a closer look at what this looks like on the lens when you are pointing light at it. And it's pretty neat because the microstructures on the surface appear as just like a grayed off or kind of like a whited off area on the glass. However, there are patterns in there which you're not able to detect just by looking at it. Just looking at the top strip with the naked eye, you'd never be able to tell that that's going to display that globe pattern. So this would definitely make a very cool, maybe science fair project presentation or just something to mess around with if you are a laser enthusiast. I definitely think this is something that's worth adding to your collection, especially for the price. And it's also nice to set up some type of tripod with it too, that way you can steady it a lot better. And I personally found that the lasers that looked best were my 473 nanometer uh, blue laser and then this 650 nanometer red right here. I used one of my cheap green uh, 532 nanometer lasers, but that one was just spreading too much light everywhere. And I also tried a purplish UV 405 nanometer laser, but the visibility wasn't very good on that one and the camera wasn't picking up the color very well. And just some quick little fun facts that are provided by the Material Shop website. This is the same technology that is used in machine vision systems, 3D sensors, barcode scanners, measurement solutions. And even the Microsoft Connect uses a diffractive optical element to project an infrared invisible laser dot pattern. So that's going to wrap up this video. I'll have all the video links in the description down below. If you guys found this interesting in any way at all, hit that like button down below. And if you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button for lots of awesome laser videos just like this. And as always, thank you for watching.